Hi, and welcome to Gadget News and Review. We are home to some of the coolest gadgets, and the best consumer reviews online, buyers guides and features. If you like our review please subscribe for more upcoming reviews videos. Asus ProArt StudioBook Pro X Review. A laptop so pro it says it twice. Everyone is a prosumer these days. Whether you're getting some freelance work done on the side, live streaming your gameplay or even making short films for YouTube, powerful workstations are becoming more popular. And, that's why the Asus Pro Art Studio Book Pro X is here. This laptop is strapped with pro-level hardware top to bottom, from an Intel Xeon processor to Nvidia Quadro graphics. And while it's definitely an expensive device, you're getting a level of performance that you can't find in many places. At the time of this writing we don't have pricing or release date information for the Asus Pro Art Studio Book Pro X. However, just by, well, looking at this laptop we can tell it's not going to be cheap. This device, along with the rest of the Asus Pro Art Studio Book lineup announced at IFA 2019 is packed with incredibly powerful hardware, so you should expect a price tag to match. The Asus Pro Art Studio Book Prox is definitely a device where if you have to ask the price, you probably don't need it. This is a workstation designed first and foremost for creative professionals. Just looking at the Asus Pro Art Studio Book Pro X and you'll know this is a workstation. It's thicker than pretty much anything else on the market and has more ports to match. It's definitely not something you're likely to see sitting in a coffee shop, that's for sure. However, thanks to that thickness, the keyboard on the Asus Pro Art Studio Book Pro X is dream to type on. Nice and deep with the perfect amount of feedback, typing on this thing all day actually sounds like a pleasant experience. But then there's the screen pad. Look, we know that this is Asus effort at introducing the next big thing, and we can kind of see an appeal, but we're way too clumsy for this kind of input. While using the Asus Pro Art Studio Book Pro X, we kept knocking the screen pad out of touchpad mode, and when we wanted to click on something we had to sort through menus to reactivate it. Because the Asus Pro Art Studio Book Pro X is packed with up to an Intel Xeon E2276M processor, an Nvidia Quadro RTX 5000 and up to 128GB of RAM, this laptop is going to be a monster. We didn't get a chance to run any performance benchmarks on this laptop, but just looking at the specs on offer, we can pretty confidently say that you won't hit any snags running software on this behemoth. Even editing 4K video isn't going to make this laptop break a sweat. And, because the laptop is so thick, we're confident that Asus has packed in a cooling system that will see that Xeon chip boost high and stay boosted, so you can get good performance throughout a long project. In theory, this is a cool technology, but in practice, we don't think it's quite there yet. However, if you pair this laptop with a mouse, the screen pad might actually become useful, something we'd like to test. As for ports, you're getting Ethernet, USB a 3.1 and 2 Thunderbolt 3 ports on the right side of the laptop. Over on the left, you'll find the power jack, headphone out, HDMI, two more USB 3.1 ports and an SD card slot. Finally, a pro laptop that has all the ports professionals need, without having to rely on a dongle. The Asus Pro Art Studio Book Pro X is obviously a laptop for professionals, Pro wouldn't be in the name of the device twice otherwise, but it's good to know that Asus appears to have taken the needs of creatives and professionals into consideration when designing this device. Still, for most users, you'll likely find more value elsewhere. The amount of people that actually need this kind of horsepower is pretty slim, especially in a portable form factor. This is especially true when you consider the hefty price tag that will more than likely accompany this device.